at a meet the press encounter on Monday, the DC touted the developmental projects implemented by the MPP-led government in the district. He also admitted some 13 projects, that is the rehabilitation of KGB Community Library, construction of Chips Compound at Bungpa, Dodobetel, Goldsmith, Dapa, and some six and three unit classroom blocks were started by the NDC government, but work was done and paid for by the current administration. The KGB District Assembly is vigorously pursuing the government flagship programs. Among them include the following. One district one factory and planting for export and rural development. Under the one district, one factory and the planting for export and rural development, the assembly has entered into partnership with Quota Red, a palm oil manufacturing company to establish 34,000 oil palm nursery for distribution to farmers. An amount of 100,000 has been dedicated for it. The assembly is also introducing a new ginger variety in the district. This type of ginger is known as the Peruvian ginger. This is also to be distributed to the farmers to apply on trial basis, which will finally be produced in large uh, scale. Some farmers have started planting it in the district and the results very soon. In an exclusive interview with Join, if the DC bemoans the very low internally generated fund for any meaningful development. Uh, things are so difficult, I must be frank. But uh, we, are, uh, we are able to do so many things, especially with the IGF. Since uh, the creation of this uh, uh, district, since uh, uh, 1989. No DC has ever used um, IGF to uh, establish anything, but uh, during my uh, regime, I've been able to uh, build a, a market from uh, IGF. All the same, it is not uh, uh, very encouraging. So we are only appealing. On investment, the DCE says the district is endowed with industrial clay deposit for the manufacture of ceramics and tiles. He is therefore calling on investors and industries to consider exploring this for development. We have a, a deposit of a industrial clay that can be used for a paint and then other uh, quality tiles. So we are only appealing to investors to come around to prosper, prospect on the, this uh, uh, clay, so that uh, at least uh, if uh, we have an uh, investor who comes in to go into this uh, clay uh, manufacturing of uh, paint and, and uh, tiles, maybe the assembly will get uh, money to fund this uh, projects. Otherwise, things are so difficult, I must, I must be frank. On education, he says he feels bad to see pupils seated on the floor to study or write examination, but says the district is doing its best to address the situation. It really is, is very bad. I must confess, it's very bad. And so that's why quickly we want to do something about it. So we are only waiting for a conference to come so we'll get some money for people to also get this furniture for these various schools. Ochami Asiedu Echia has this to say on KGB Township Roads and Development. In respect of the town roads is so much important because you can see the district capital, we are lacking uh, 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 roads. All the roads are very, very bad. So we are appealing to the assembly to do something quickly about it. And then certainly the new developing area, there are no layouts in KGB. There are no layouts. There are a lot of people are developing houses all over the asked of KGB. In case of any disaster, the agencies responsible cannot get access to take care of the people. When we talk of fire, water, or whatever natural disaster, we find it difficult to rescue our people. We have been given a 15, 15 kilometer package. And so I'm thinking that uh, I'll bring it to the town so that uh, that part of the road that has not been 
done will be done seriously so that we'll have a, a smooth uh, download uh, system. For Joy News, Peter Sen, KGB, Akan.